Hey everybody, I'm Nick here and welcome back to Receiver 2! We are not at baseline, so there's actually some pressure on us here. My headphones, my headset is way too loud. And this load is taking forever, oh my gosh. Like, I know this load takes forever sometimes, but this is... This is ridiculous even for that. There we go. Alright. First off. Let's hope this isn't the run where I get immediately killed. To be fair, I do absolutely hate this stairwell. Safe. Don't mind me, I'm using the wrong buttons. Alright, so that's a dead end. Which is good to know, I suppose. Means I don't feel bad about having to go the other way. Fortunately, we just can't really see that great. very many guns. I'm just going to try and stay at a bird's eye view. Gonna do this the safe way.
Well, that doesn't really help us right now. It will be useful if and or when we get down there in the future. That is a drone. Never in a million years would I dream to hack one of those while it was still in the air. We can get over there, but I think the fall would kill us to get down to the next level. Oh, it's a drone up over there. I don't know if that makes me feel better or worse. Now, my game is getting laggy. That was a sleeping turret. The threat has become expert in hijacking our attention and inverting our priorities. They make the useless seem important and urgent. The sky is always falling. The, the world is always falling. You are always missing out or, or just missing something. What you are actually missing is the one thing they are trying to hide from you and can only be found within. As you build your mind tech, you will become more complete, each part fitting into place until you are a functional whole. What was important was always right here. Yourself and those around you you can trust. like a Beyblade. I'm very concerned about finding a sleeping turret because those are introduced like forever ago. <laughs> and then we like haven't seen them at all.
Sleeping turrets terrify me. Doing really well. Maybe I need to be using my flashlight more. I, I just, I hate it. I hate that sound. Oh, okay. Fucking sleepy turret, man. I, I just, I can't fucking... You can't fucking see the, the bar. Oh my god, hacking these things is so fucking hard. I just want the sound to go away, man. You know what? This is good science. Where do I want to shoot you? That's the taser. <laughs> so yeah, no one in their right mind would ever try to hack that. Like, while well, it's flying and dangerous. That much is confirmed for me, which is which is worthwhile. Sleepy turrets being a thing is gonna make me paranoid forever. Using the noise as a notification system is very much worth it, in my opinion, which is why it's worth getting rid of stuff. Wow, that's just a full clip. I hear a tape.
gotta be a drone. The question is where? When your firearm discharges, it cycles another round into the chamber. Your own internal feedback systems are critical. You are the weapon, and mind attacks are your internal mechanism. A slight misfit of components will cause a feed jam, leading to a misfire, resulting in death. Ensuring that each mind tech is within tolerances will enable your proper operation and survival. I need a better view. It's a drone. It's the only way, like, I'd be able to find a... Sharpshooter, noise. Where is this drone, dude? There's a gun turret all the way up there. It's not rotating. Is it actually a gun turret from below? It's got to be on the floor above. I'm just, I, I don't know where it, it Okay, there's a drone in there.
just gotta be patient. Divide us and control us while while giving us the, the illusion of community. They grant power and responsibility to the weakest of us while giving us the illusion of meritocracy. We have been coasting through existence with our eyes closed, and now is our last chance to awaken. Question becomes is it even worth Alright, so it wasn't a drone that spotted us or we'd be being chased. That may not be true. Oh, was it the was it the gun up there? Yeah, I'd believe that. I'm now super paranoid about sleeping turrets, which is the point, I think. curtains drawn in here is convenient. Okay, there's at least one or two drones patrolling the next area. Sorry, there's at least two. One to the right and one above and apparently to the left.
When the founding fathers signed the Declaration of Independence, the Fabrica di Armi Pietro Barretta already had 250 years of experience making firearms, making them the oldest arms company in the world. Beretta was a huge name in Italy since the 1500s, but didn't achieve world renown until 1985, when they signed the contract to equip the U.S. Armed Forces with their new Beretta 92FS, now known as the M9 service pistol. Since then, Beretta has continued to expand its operations, acquiring competitors like Benelli, known for its tactical pump-action shotguns, uh, Uberti, a leading manufacturer of replica firearms, and Franchi, known for its Spas 12 semi-auto shotgun. The U.S. did not entirely trust Italy, considering they literally invented fascism and joined Team Hitler in World War II, so they required that Beretta build all M9 supervisors on American soil under American supervision. If you have a Beretta pistol, look at her. she has her green card. That was a lot of bullets. We really don't have the leeway. very close. Oh jeez, I don't know if I can get past that. Okay, it, it does turn. it very quickly. I think that was bugging out, I'm not gonna lie. We are all taught to carefully monitor what we put into our bodies. We need to eat this and avoid that, and have this we other thing in moderation. But we are never <laughs> how to curate what we put into That's our bodies. That's what's fucking left of it. There's no use having a healthy body if, if your mind is poisoned. Now, the threat has used this control to remove choice over what you consume. If you uncritically view media, you are directly allowing the threat to, to infiltrate your thoughts and to compromise your brain from the inside. Yay! We have achieved! We are at three out of five. Look, we only need a two win streak. A two more win streak for this to work us to succeed and have beaten the game we could be done in as little as two more episodes do i think that's gonna happen i really wish i 
have no idea what they're going to start throwing at me. The, the asleep turrets. Yep, those are going to get me. I, at least once, I think. They almost got me today, but not quite. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, I'm just gonna, it's, it's better to let it load and exit out once it's loaded in, but I appreciate you guys stopping in and watching this episode of Receiver 2. I hope that you uh, enjoyed it. I will see you next time. Why is this called a Yeet Cannon? Well, that's going to be the, the name for next episode, but I will see you all next time, and until then, keep your gears turning.